Concordia returning home after a tough stretch on the road, looking for a win against a nationally ranked opponent at the Gang Off Center on Friday night. 18th ranked Minnesota State Moorhead making their way into the Gangelhoff Center. As the teams came out, Moorhead getting a bucket early. Charlie Chapman, one of the better three-point shooters in the league, space on the wing, hit that one for a brief Moorhead lead in the opening minute. But Concordia would assert themselves after that. Brent Barr is active early. Turnaround on the baseline for the Concordia big man. DJ Hamilton would hit another three for Minnesota State Moorhead. But Concordia going to the front court in the early going. Great feed, Isaiah Thomas across the lane, got the assist. Brent Barr is the finish. And then Thomas scoring as well, three-pointer as Concordia rotated the ball to him on the wing. Cole Olstad finding Thomas again, and another make. Back-to-back -back threes early on for Thomas. He scored seven of their first 12 points. Kenny Olafeso the steal, finishing with style points. The reverse went jam in transition for Kenny on the break. Alex Novak would answer with a basket and a foul on the other end for Moorhead, but Concordia kept finding the open man. Therese Van Pelt to Cole Olstad for three. Brent Barr is catching it on the block again over the top of Eric Olson, finishing with the right hand. Barr's had 12 points in the first half, getting an assist there as he kicked it out to Cole Olstad for the quarter three. Cole would hit a couple in the first half. Peter Lafeso, creativity in the lane, spinning around DJ Hamilton, finishing off glass. Cole Olstad playing some defense. Great block recovering on Charlie Chapman, avoided the foul, stopped that transition opportunity. And then Therese Van Pelt, just 6-1, but he can get putbacks as well. Concordia led at the half by 11. Peter Lafeso early in the second half blocked by Andrew Van Havermat, but Concordia would get their offense going again. Isaiah Thomas, another three with the shot clock running down, hit it from the corner. And then Cordell Smith, a nice spark off the bench. The sophomore would hit a three from the corner and then showing he can get to the basket as well, driving baseline, absorbing contact and banking it in. Concordia would get out and transition once again midway through the second half. Kenny Olafeso finishing strong with the left hand. And then Therese Van Pelt's spin move as he got around the defense. Nice finish off glass. Concordia would maintain their lead throughout. They win it 84-71, a second straight win over a ranked opponent at home. Concordia plays Minnesota Crookston tomorrow night.